Hello, hello. How are you today? I'm fine. I'm fine. Thank you very much. And I do hope you are too. Good morning, my beautiful pupils at home. How are you this morning? I believe you are all doing good. Yes. I'm here again on a subject that we call English grammar. And we are on a new topic. But before I unveil the new topic, let's just remind ourselves of what we learned the last time I was here. The last time I was here on English grammar, we discussed us expressing past action, okay? And then, and then we discussed about regular and irregular verbs. Yes, I told you that regular verbs, they are verbs that form their past tense by adding letter D or ED to it. Example, jump. The past tense for jump will be what? Jumped. J-U-M-P, jump. And for jumped, we say what? J-U-M-P-E-D. Then I have call. Call, C-A-L-L. -L. The past tense for it will be what? Called. C A L L E D. Dance. D A N C E. Dance. And the past tense for dance will be what? D A N C E D. You had letter D to make the past tense of dance. Then I told you irregular verbs. Yes, irregular verbs, these are verbs that form their past action by mostly changing the vowel sound. And at times, the consonants too have to change. Okay? Okay, like now, I have begin. The first tense for begin is what? Began. B-E-G-I-N, begin. B-E-G-A-N, began. Sleep. S-L-E-E-P, sleep. And the first tense for sleep is what? Sleep. S-L-E-P. C, slept, okay? Yes. That is that on our revision on the last topic. Now, let us go to our topic for today. Our topic for today is use of past tense in question. Use of what? Use of past tense in question, okay? Good. From this topic, what is expected of us? What are our objectives from this topic? Let's try and see. At the end of this topic, we should be able to do what? To use past tense in question. And we should be able to ask questions correctly. Yes. You don't just ask questions anyhow. But what? We should ask questions correctly. Okay? Now, let us start with this. We use words like did, was, where to make a question in the past tense. Look at this example I have here. Did he practice? That is the question. Did he practice? Yes, he practiced. Were you afraid? I was afraid. Were you afraid? Was it heavy? Because it is past. It has happened. So you don't say, is it heavy? You are not carrying the load presently. But it has happened. You've carried the box. So you say, was it heavy? Then you answer, yes, it was. Oh no, it wasn't. Did they have fun? Yes, you, you, you were taking out on a um, picnic and coming back. Somebody will just ask you, did you have fun? Then you answer, oh, mommy, yes, we had fun. Yes, I had fun. Okay, good. We have more examples. 
What happened? How did you hurt? Because it has happened before. So you say, how did you hurt? Did the paramedics arrive quickly? Who called for help? Who called? Not who calls or who call, but what? Who called for help? Because it is a past tense. Okay? Do you get it? Good. I have more. Look at this discussion between Doctor and Tom. It's a dialogue. It's a dialogue between who? Doctor and Tom. Okay? What did doctor say? Doctor said, so Tom, how did you hurt yourself? What were you doing? Can you note that? Doctor did not say, how do you hurt yourself? What was you doing? No, doctor did not say that. What doctor said was, how did you hurt yourself? What were you doing? Okay, you can take note of that auxiliary verb in past tense. It is the question was asked in what? Past tense. And Tom said, I was riding my squad bike. And the next question the doctor asked was, were you riding first? The doctor never said, are you riding first? No. But because it has happened, the doctor said what? Were you riding first? And what was Tom's response? Well, I wasn't riding very fast. That was the response of Tom. And what did the doctor say next? The doctor said, and then what happened? And then what happened? Happened, past tense. And Tom said, I went on the path towards a tree. Can you imagine? He went off the path towards a tree. Doctor now said, did you crash into it? Are you, not, are you taking note of that? Did, did you crash into it? And Tom said, yes. And I hurt myself quite badly. Wow, sorry, Tom. And doctor said, you certainly did. Let me have a look. Yes, this is a dialogue between a doctor and Tom. And the dialogue was in past tense. The questions were in past tense, okay? The doctor asked Tom different questions using where, did, okay? Worse, I was riding my bike. Were you riding first? I wasn't riding very fast. All these are past tense. Okay? Good. Now look at this. Grammar quiz. WH question. Past simple. You have to tell me what to use. If I will read the question, you tell me the correct answer. Dash did you do yesterday? I went shopping. So my option is, is it what did you do yesterday or where did you do yesterday or what did you do yesterday? Who can tell me the correct answer? Did I hear you say what? Yes. What did you do yesterday? And the answer is, I went shopping. Pass. Thanks. The next question is, Dash, did you get to San Francisco? Who did you get to Fran San Francisco? Where did you get to San Francisco? How did you get to San Francisco? Which is the correct option? Yes, how? How did you get to San Francisco? And the answer is, we traveled, first thing, we traveled by bus. Okay, good. Number three. Dash old were you last year? Dash old were you last year? Option one, A. 
Why old I were you last year? What old were you last year? How old were you last year? Who can tell me the correct answer? Good. How old were you last year? And then the answer I have here is I was 23. How old were you last year? I was 23. Okay? Number four. Dash was that noise. Dash was that noise. Option A. What was that noise? Where was that noise? Who was that noise? Yes, what was that noise? You're correct. It was just the wind. Was. We use the word, the auxiliary verb, was. What was that noise? It was just the wind. Number five. Dash were they? Where were they? What were they? When were they? What is the correct WH question to use? Where were they? They were at the library. Where? Past action. They were at the library. Number six. Dash, did you have lunch? How did you have lunch? What did you have lunch? When did you have lunch? Which one is the correct question to use? When did you have lunch? And the answer here is, we had lunch at noon. We had lunch at noon. Yes, number seven. I have, Dash was your teacher. What was your teacher? Who was the teacher? Why was the teacher? What's the correct option there? Who, who was your teacher? And the answer here is Miss Jones was my teacher. Miss Jones was my teacher. Then I have Dash, were you late? Dash, were you late? When were you late? Mm -mm, that one is not correct. Why were you late? Yes. Who were you late? No. So we have what? Why were you late? Then you can say, I missed the bus. I missed the bus. That was why I was late. I still have some more. Look at my number nine here. Dash X the cake. Dash X the cake. What ate the cake? Mm -mm. Who ate the cake? Yes. How ate the cake? No. So the correct option here is what? Who ate the cake? It's a question. Who ate the cake? And then I have Seward ate it. Seward ate it. Who ate the cake? Seward ate it. Okay? Good. I still have more. Are you not enjoying it? I'm enjoying it and I believe you are enjoying it too. Good. Dash was that on the phone? It's a question. Dash was that on the phone? Where was that on the phone? Mm -mm. It is not correct. Why was that on the phone? No. Who was that on the phone? That is the correct question to use. Who was that on the phone? And the answer here, it was Steven. It was Steven. So as who? Steven. Good. I still have more. Dash, did she say? Dash, did she say? What did she say? When did she say? Who did she say? And the correct one is, what did, this, what did she say? And then the answer here is, she said goodbye. What did she say? She said goodbye. Let's see how more. Dash did they graduate? 
dash did they graduate what did they graduate mm -mm. who did they graduate no when did they graduate correct when did they graduate and the answer here is they graduated in 2014 they graduated in 2014 beautiful i still have more look at this that time did you go to bed that time did you go to bed how time did you go to bed no doesn't sound good when time did you go to bed no that one doesn't sound good at all what time did you go to bed beautiful that is the correct question to you what time did you go to bed and the answer here is i went to bed at 11 o'clock the answer did not say i go to bed at 11 o'clock no it is past tense i went to bed at 11 o'clock take note of that i went to bed at 11 o'clock went i still have more dash did he say dash did he see a doctor dash did he see a doctor who did he see a doctor no that sounds so bad where did he see a doctor no why did he see a doctor beautiful he hurt his hand that is the answer why did he see a doctor because he hurt his hand he hurt his hand that was why he saw a doctor yes let's see how more dash where your bags dash where your bags why were your bags no how were your bags no where were your bags yes beautiful where were your bags they were on the train can you take note of this where 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 were your bags they were on the train okay if it is only one that rule of thumb card i taught you some weeks ago if it is only one bag you say where was your bag but when we have two or more you say where were your bags remember to have the heads for your bags and then your answer is they were on the train okay they were on the train then the last one I have here is this. Dash was the movie. Dash was the movie. Who was the movie? Uh-uh, no, no, we don't say that. Where was the movie? No. How was the movie? Yes, that is the correct question to ask. How was the movie? It was great. How was the movie? It was great. Okay? Yes. How was the class? It was great. Past tense. So these are the ways we can express our question in past tense. Remember I told you, we make use of what? Did. Was. Were. All auxiliary verb in past action. Okay? Don't forget. When the question is asked in past tense, you answer the question in past tense. Okay? Like I told you, Dash, did you get to San Francisco? How did you get to San Francisco? And the answer here is, we traveled. We traveled by bus. How was the movie? It was great. Where were your bags? They were on the train. Please don't forget, okay? Please don't forget. That will be the end of our class for today.
and it is the end of our English grammar for the term. Okay, we're rounding up the English grammar. This is the last topic on our scheme of work on English grammar for the term. I will see you again. Funes, I miss you. I love you all. Please stay safe. And like I used to tell you, play, but don't play rough. And always read your books. Bye. I love you.